Are y'all going to Vegas this like in two weeks? Yeah. I'll be out there too. I think I'm going to have a mansion, so y'all going to have to pull up. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm dead serious. I have the pool, the jacuzzi, all. Y'all going to have to pull up. <laughs> we in Vegas, it's only right be 100 degrees outside, my guy. What's going on, guys? It's Overtime Larry. I'm here with Scotty Pippen Jr. and Kenya Martin Jr. We about to just chop it up, you know? See how it's been at Peach Jam, right? Yeah, sure. All right. How's Peach Jam been so far? It's been good. We 3 and 1 right now, so everything's good. It's been solid. We should be 4 and 0, but we don't need to be so What was that L like? It was tough. We came out slow. We came out slow, and then like we came back, and then it was just it was too much already. So it was just like, yeah, we just took it out. I, I was here last year when, when the soldiers won, so yeah. I gotta I gotta represent. The last time I saw y'all, we was, we was like doing yoga. Yeah. Y'all <laughs> still be doing yoga? During the school season. Huh? During the school season, like, our, our, one of the guys keep telling us to come and do it, but it's just like... We don't like doing it, like, It's too hot. Too hot. Way too hot. I remember, <laughs> I remember your exact words. You're like, you have too much clothes on. Yeah, no. Y'all didn't believe us. Like, y'all thought, like, shirts and stuff would be fine. Like, no, after I was five minutes, pants. Yeah, pants up. After five minutes, everything has to go off. <laughs> Where were you guys um, watching the NBA draft? I was in, I was in Florida. I was in yeah. Florida. I don't even, even think I was. I probably, I think I was working out, and then I just stopped to like work to see who got my first or whatever. So yeah. NBA summer league has been lit. Yeah. You, what well, you been watching it? Yeah, not a little bit. bit. Yeah, I've been watching a little bit. It's like some of the top guys are like and stuff like that. They've been playing pretty good. Obviously, like the first couple games. You think Aiden was the was the best choice for number one? I haven't really seen too much in his game, so I don't know. I haven't seen him in the NBA. Like, what about you? Yeah, no, it was and him and Marvin are pros. Like it could have gone either way, but they're they're both they're both doing pretty good. I think they're both in the NBA. I I know y'all peep. <laughs> I know y'all peep Leangelo Ball. Like, he just dropped fifty three yesterday. For real? In the JBA. Uh, <laughs> what? I didn't, know, I didn't even know he was playing for the JBA. Yeah. I, I didn't even know what he was doing, but, yeah. yeah I'm going to have to say about that. <laughs> I hear that. <laughs> Yo, did you, um, you heard the new Yeezy album? Yeah. You went, you, didn't you guys go to the listening party? The listening party? Yeah. Tell me about that, bro, because I didn't get the invite. It was, you got my number? Y'all both got my number. It was crazy. It was just like, the setting that, like, the place was at, it was like kind of, Weird. It was in like the middle of the mountain. It was just like a whole bunch of dirt and stuff. And there was like a hill, and then it was just like a like a fire and like <laughs> like bonfire. Bon yes, yeah. it was like, like like a lot of bodies just like jumping. It was listening. There was no like, service. In your no phone. service. No nothing. So like there was no contact with people like outside of it. So it was just like. So you, you couldn't even like snap it, put it on IG, nothing I like that? I took a snap it, but like, I had to post it like where it is. <laughs> but you can't even wear fresh kicks there too, because no, your no. kicks is getting smoked. And like hella people that's yeah. like stomping. Like, it was like people touching up on you. Like, yeah. Yeah. yeah, no, that's like currently the town's usually like off white Air Force Ones. I'm like, nah, like, <laughs> too much dirt. It was like so many people. It was crazy. All right, so since we're talking about kicks, you got the Gucci slides on, you got the Nike slides on. How many pairs of kicks y'all both y'all got in your closet? I don't know. A rough estimate. I don't know. I start counting after a while. <laughs> I have a lot. I have a lot. But I gave a lot of them away, like stuff I didn't really wear. But I started stacking up on stuff that I do wear, so it's getting back really high. But yeah, what size are you? Like 14, 15. Oh, See, I can't even. No, can't I, can't even. Go, I can't go to the store no more. Like, uh, the other day I went and I was trying to get 15s. No chance. Order all of them online. Are y'all on that Fortnite wave or not? Yeah. I'm, yeah. I'm way better no. than you. No. He, he said he's a Fortnite guy, but he can't mess with me. He can't? No. So you be carrying the squad? Yes. All right, all right, well, when I get home, check your Instagrams. Over time, I'm going to send you all my clips and we'll see who's nice. I'll be streaming on, I'll be streaming on I'll, Twitch I'll sometimes. So you can. I say less, you already here. All right, hold on. I heard like somebody coming to your school soon. Who? I can, I can, you could FaceTime him now, right? 
Who? Ronnie, nah. I don't know him like that either. Where he going? People say he is, people say he's not. It's only right. You think he can play varsity though? You think he'll... He's in eighth grade, so they don't, they don't let they, him. They don't let... Okay. Yeah, in some, yeah. Only in some states they let only that happen. States, yeah. California, probably not. California has a lot of rules. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. He might become our one. So what do y'all think about LeBron, L.A. Bron? It's... I was in Columbia when I heard the news. Yeah, it was... I mean, I kind of felt like he was, but it's going to be weird, like... No matter what he does, I think I think it's still gonna be like Kobe. Like Kobe is the Lakers. Like if you're trying to say like LeBron's like the best Laker. Like unless LeBron goes out and wins six rings with them, then that would be most of the story. But that's realistically not gonna happen. So. Yeah, it's not. And then and then they gotta play the Warriors. Who? Yeah, but still, he starts to play the Warriors, and it's gonna be even harder to make it to the finals. So I'm just I'm just waiting to see like how that's gonna. Work. The Warriors just won two years in a row. And they just added the Marcus Cousins. Yeah. So. I bet the East Coast is going to be wack this year, though. The East Coast is going to be trash. Yeah. I'm, I'm a Knicks fan, and I'm just a, I'm a little excited because we got Kevin Knox, and he's been, he's been doing his thing. But I'm going to be honest, like, we, we're going to be bad for the next couple of years. But what's up, though? Like, I, what's new? Because it's summertime. What haven't y'all done that y'all want to do? We had like a couple weeks off, a little bit, and we just came out here. And then after this, we started some other tournaments in Vegas and stuff. That's going to be fun. When we go back to LA, probably go to the beach or something. I don't know. Chill. Yeah. Yeah, chill. We're going back to the parties, stuff like that. Are y'all going to Vegas this, like in two weeks? Yeah. I'll be out there too. I think I'm going to have a mansion, so y'all going to have to pull up. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm dead serious. I have yeah. the pool, the jacuzzi, all. I'm gonna have to pull up. <laughs> we in Vegas, it's only right to be 100 degrees outside, my guy. <laughs> I know it's, it's kind of regular for you guys to see celebrities and like ex NBA players in the stands in your games, but how cool is it to just like interact with Kevin Durant and you know see Chris Paul on the regular walk by you? Um, I feel like it's cool just because like, you see him on TV and people think that. Uh, so different, but like they're just cool in person, just the same as us. Yeah. Yeah, that was cool. Like, I guess like other people saying on TV and stuff, and like they're just like regular, like, just normal people like us. We just play basketball and like ended up famous. So that was cool interacting with them and like see like, like what they do off the court and stuff like that. Sierra so Canyon gonna win another yeah. state title. State sure. No question. No question. Easy. Easy. Why is Sierra Canyon? That school in California, that like, that everybody, you know, you need to go there. Like, you know, like before we went there or after? Are you talking about in general, like people go there? Yeah, why do people go there? I don't know. The environment. Well, I the went there because I knew like a couple people going there. I knew there was gonna be like on a national like skate stage and like a lot of attention. That's why I went there. I guess from before, just like the players that went there, like it's all sports and stuff like that. It just brings like a lot of attention. Like this year, we knew if we brought in like the right pieces, like after everyone graduated, like we could win a championship. So I guess like us winning that open event championship, it kind of it's kind of gonna like bring a lot of people on to come to school in the future. So yeah. You guys are at Peach Jam, yeah. and you know Coach Cal, Coach K, Bill South, Tom Izzo, they're at your games. How does that feel like you know playing against these prestige, like playing in front of these prestigious coaches? Yeah. Bro, this is real big because everyone is hungry to get those offers. Everyone wants their spot. Everyone wants us to be here and just to be on the biggest stage. So I feel like it's real important just to show your skills out here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, it's real big to show your skills out here. Like, all of, like really every coach in America is probably, like, either on the sideline or in the, like, in the area. So, like, obviously, like, you see them and stuff like that, but it just kind of, like, puts, like, a switch on the line. Like, just, like, play as best as you can, like, play right and stuff like that. You even gotta like think about the the, the little things, the hustling, because yeah, that's all they're yeah. that's what they're looking for, right? Yeah, they're looking for like guys like hustle down on the floor, get all fifty fifty balls, stuff like that. Like help your teammates up and stuff like that, and like don't kind of don't have like a bad attitude and stuff like that. So. Mhm. Mm all right, I'm gonna wrap it up with this last question. How big of a summer is this for you? It's real big for me because I feel like I see Eric I didn't show my full potential. 
and just playing with open soldiers, I've done that, and just playing better, scoring more, and being more of a leader. Yeah, how about you, KJ? That was real big for me also. Like last year for 16s, I came here, and uh, for PJM, I got hurt. So I really didn't get to like, show what I like, could do. And like this school year, I played pretty good, but I felt like I could show more. And like so this year, for like this summer, like I just want to be more of a leader and like show like I can do more for coming up next year. All right, big year ahead. We signing out. I'm here with Scotty and KJ. Peach Jam. Hopefully, yeah, they can they eat those peaches later. Shout out Overtime. What up, guys? It's Overtime Larry. How you feel after watching this video? Dope, right? We got more of them right here. Check them out and click subscribe. If you haven't done that, you're actually slacking. I'm upset.